Hello there, how's it going? Uh, I'm Sol and this is part 43 of my Roma Serectum 3 Let's Play as Athens. Now previously, after some stiff resistance, Thessalus managed to take Nicopolis and I've got an army uh, here uh, led by Penelias and we're going to go and take Gordium which is around here somewhere. Now it just needs some art so let's just take uh, Let's get the script one. Sir, yes, Just to bolster him yes, here. Uh, let's get My send Lord. this unit up. Just to cheer the place up a little bit. <laughs> oh look at this, we've got the Slickers here now, they're besieging Halicanasas. That'll be interesting to see what they're up to. There's another half stack army there as well. Uh, now then, let's get these guys out of here, they don't need to be there. And we'll send them up to Ephesus. We'll put you in there. Uh, no, we can't get back. Uh, Alright, we'll send this ship here back. And we'll put you in this port here. <coughs> no, I haven't got any money left. Um, let's see if I can generate some somewhere. Now we've got this army what? here, led by Mausolus. And um, I'm retraining these guys, aren't I? All right, we'll leave that for now. We'll come back to that. How is Priam? Okay, um, we're going to be besieging there, I don't think we yes, need these, I'm just wondering if I should yes, send them over. Boss. I think we'll send them over there actually, Sir. to Nicopolis. Yes. Oh, no, we haven't got any room for them. <laughs> that would break. I'll tell you what to do, let's merge some of these guys up. What have we got around? Can we top them up with any troops from anywhere? There's some there. And there's some there. Okay, let's merge these guys together. Uh, uh, we'll send you back to here, I think. Let's keep... There's only two, we'll just join them up there. We'll take these um, marines over and we'll Sir. give them to them. Oh no, I'll tell you what, let's Sir. mess them up as well. Yes. Keep it a little bit more compact. What have we got here? My lord. My lord. Yes. My lord. My lord. There we go. Now, where was that other unit? Yes. Uh, oh, oh, send you back again then. And I think they yes, can get in now, can't they? Right, now, the oh, that's Mercy's. That's handy, and we'll send you back. Now you're going to have to go back to Pergamon to get, eh, uh, sorry, Pella, to get retrained, can it? Oh, you could reach. I oh, didn't expect that. Okay. Now then. I queued up some stuff in here, didn't I? So, the wooden wall, 42%. Oh, that's being repaired, doesn't it? Uh, Alright, let's take these out. What does that give us? 7985. An assassin. Not a very good one. But never mind. We, oh, I'll tell you what. Let's see if he can kill this guy. He won't hit a thing. Go on. He got him and all, didn't he? There you are. And he gets himself a brownie point. Assassin ready. I'll put you back in there. I don't think they actually protect um, your settlement. They're more you have to attack with them but I'll put our spy in here because very often after you take a new settlement then you get 
um, spies and um, try to cause unrest, try to get any cause unrest, and assassins try to assassinate if you got a governor in there or sabotage your buildings. And I, find, I found that a spy seems to prevent that, because quite often with Philip, was it Philippuses or Philippi and Pella, when anybody's been trying, any assassin been trying to get in there, spies especially, been getting executed when they've been caught and the um, assassins have been sort of hovering around outside, they, they don't seem to be getting to get in. So your spies do a preventive job uh, for, your, for your settlement and the assassins do the attacking stuff and kill people, if you've got good ones of course. So uh, again, I always try to pass on inf information I have to for people who don't know the, some of the things, and for newcomers that have never played Rome's Rectum, or maybe even Rome Total War for that matter. So a, a, little, a useful bit of information to, to carry around with you. The other one as well was diplomats. If you put a diplomat in settlements, um, it helps prevent against brave, being braved by other diplomats if you, uh, if they've got decent sort of like um, retinue themselves, decent status, uh, they can prove quite valuable against bravery, uh, especially in settlements that don't have a governor in them. So make use of them because believe me, a lot of people don't. I've watched some let's plays and I, have, I very rarely see too many. Uh, let's players using, u utilizing diplomats in that way, and, uh, or spies for that matter. They use them for searching out and opening gates to settlements or whatever fortresses, and assassins obviously for killing people, and diplomats for being diplomats. And um, quite often you don't see them use, you know, realize that uh, they don't seem to realize they have other uses, and. Um, well, I've discovered it to be like that. Um, again, I just picked it up from other people. I, I didn't actually research and try it for myself uh, through experience. I, I did read about it somewhere on the Total War Centre, and that's where I get most of my information. And um, I just try to, sort of, you know, keep all that shit together and. Then <laughs> remember to use it when the time comes because <laughs> actually my memory is quite shocking as I've, I, I've said many times before right okay I'm getting sidetracked here now then um, what did I want to do here now now I wanted to um, he's a good assassin this one isn't he yeah top notch Pergamon assassin at war I wonder if we could kill him uh, diplomat rather. Closing in for the kill. Only twenty nine percent chance. That don't sound too promising. Um now this is the sort of guy who can break a settlement unless you've got a I mean I've got a good governor in here. I mean he's only just taking it. He's intelligent. Uh, he's a family member. So, you know, the, these are expert scouting. Oh, right. Um, I mean, he's not got a lot of influence and management skills because I'm going to be using them as a as a, 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 a field general and not a governor. So we have to get somebody in there to take his place. It also costs us money to bring him out once he becomes regional governor, and that happens after two turns. On the third turn, to become regional governor. Now you want to take them out, put them in battle, it costs you money. Okay, now, uh, moving on. Let's retrain some of these guys. Oh, there's a lot of them. 33, 199, 77. Oh, right, so about a thousand denarii in total for all of them. Okay, that'll be fine. Retrain them. No, we want these have not got any experience or anything, upgrades. 
So it doesn't matter so much about the archers, but these guys uh, will bring them back to Philippi and we'll send the experienced ones up there because they're more front line, that's more front line it's going to come under attack from Dacia Scythia. Um, we want better troops in there. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, let's see now. Priam. Uh, we have to get his army sorted out. Get him some new men. Uh, we're getting these guys retrained in there. Now, in Athena, I've got an army that's just been recruited, but we're short on archers. I think I put so many ships, didn't I? Yeah, I did. So let's get another unit of Therak attack. No, let's get another unit of... Um, what have I got here? I don't want to overdo it. Another unit of Marines. And another unit of archers and we'll need a general for them okay now then can I recruit a general in Pella right we've got a general there now he'll become a governor and we'll send him up to Nicopolis in the next turn okay now what else do I want to concern myself about His ham is ready, we'll do that in a minute. Let's just check over at Syracuse. Alright, so we've got a good army here. Uh, we've got some... Oh, look at this, yeah, of course. We're retraining the other guys in here, aren't we? Okay, that's sound. That's sound, we're happy enough there. Now, my other concern, of course, is up here at Saloni. Now these guys are gathering. Now we know what they've got. They've got loads of, you know, ballistas. Three of people, well, they've got Uthobolas and stone throwing ballistas. So they're going, I'm sure they're going to be looking to come attacking us. They're not going to go to Dad's here. Um, now where's my spy? Here's some more coming here, look. And another Lithobolas. Jeez, oh. They like the siege equipment, the bloody Romanis, don't they? Aye. Uh, Quintus Lelius Balbus. So is he going to come to take over that government? Uh, that army that's not got a general. I think he'll become, he'll maybe take over them, I don't know. Because this one's got a general. Um, right, we're going to go around here and see how strong the Romani are. If I can get if I can find a way. Moving. There we go. Moving into position. Moving into position. I don't want to get blocked. There's some more there. What have you got? Just three units. Now they've taken Patavium. Three units in there. I'll be careful. Oh, for goodness sake, look at this lot. <laughs> Well, I suppose I have to be consider myself fort I'm an unfortunate place in a way because uh, the Marian reforms haven't kicked in yet. So these are all um, well, we've got Triarii there and Polybian cohorts, so and allied cohorts. So they're not they're not as strong as um, they could be with the what was this? Um, if it had the Marian reforms had kicked in. Now they're hovering around uh, Bononia here, which is owned by the Boa, as you can see, and they've got two full stacks. Oh, now I think, if I remember correctly, they're bloody allies, aren't they? They are allies. Now, we'd be handy if they declared war on one another. So right, we're going to have to get, we're going to have to strengthen our position here. Now I've got these two armies, of course, at Syracuse. Now if we come down, we can raid both sides, uh, especially Rome, because that churns out troops, conveyor belt style, 
I think Kapoor does as well actually. Uh, let's get my spy up here. What's this? A free spy. Free spy. Nothing borrows. There's some more here. Look, they blow their light. Their siege equipment, don't they? <coughs> Excuse me. I'm going to have to get my spy over here because it doesn't look as if they've expanded uh, into Galia. Against the Averni, which is a wee bit unusual to say the least. Now, you know, since the, I mean the, the way the models have done this is they've closed all the gaps through the Alps. You can't get through them. You have to go around them. Now that I think that was to stop them from expanding, the Romani from expanding so quickly into Gallia and Belgia and against the Cimbri. So um it forced them it sort of made them I don't know, it's, it's not exactly made them come east that strongly. I mean they had a bit at the start here in Peloponnese, but we sorted them out. And we pushed them back to their own turf. But it seemed to be gathered here We'll maybe try and get our spy over here in a little while and see what they've progressed. But I want to get them down here, bring my spy down here to have a look at Aretium, which has got nothing particular in there. Can you get in? Let's go and have a look in here. Let's see what sort of barracks I've got. Well, I've got a fortress. So what? Slightly can uh, you can certainly recruit units in here. Nothing fantastic in here enough, but they're strong enough. They're hmm. what's going on here? Oh, maybe well, I don't know why they want to get these and not the the proper um, cards. Oh, it's still a beta, of course, yeah, of course. Uh, right, so we know they've got military in there. Let's get you back out again, mate. We'll bring you down. And have a look in Rome. There's only one unit in there. I want to see if they get what sort of armies they've got down here. Because I want to attack both sides of the coastline. Um, I mean, yeah. Initially, I'm, I'm doing it for a bit of fun, and I don't want to sort of wipe out the Romans right too early, because um, I'm expanding pretty fast. You want to keep them in the game, so that they, I'll try and push them to go and attack the Averni or, or the Belgi uh, and the Cimbri. They, they'll have their own agendas as well. Okay, now we've got two good strong armies here. We've got Diomedes, who's we've got him on the on the river ford here, and we've got um, Orthias on this river ford there as well. So um, that's good. That's good choke points to 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 fight against these. But I am concerned about those Lithobolos, but I, I know how to overcome them. If we can keep them, if we're on the ford of the river here, I won't actually do the battle on the ford itself. We'll pull back so their uh, siege weapons can't do us any damage. Yeah, that will fuck them up, won't it? They won't be able to use them. <laughs> right, uh, now I've done enough explaining for now. I think I'm pretty much done. Um, oh. What can we do with him? Why did I leave him there then? Because um, there's nobody else to get any trade rights or anything. We've done I think we've done everybody, didn't we? Uh, did we do the Gal uh, Galatia? Just have a look. 
right then. Come down, down, down. Galicia. Galicia, sorry. Galicia. Oh, Galicai, that's it. Cancer. Galicai? Oh, no matter. I've always been shit with names. Yeah, we've got trade. We've got um, trade rights for them. I think we trade rights for most of everybody. And we just leave them there to negotiate any deals of ceasefire and lights or make them approachable. Or maybe just might die. Whatever. Um, I think that's as much as we can do here. How much as we can do there. May as well retrain him. Uh, we sorted that there. Pretty much building everywhere. Except there. <laughs> Hera, any good to us? Nah, not really. Oh, that might be good though. Fertility, yeah, let's put that in there now. There we go. Help the population growth. Right, we're ready to move on. Okay, so let's go and take Gordium now. Um, do I need to add any more? No, we've got enough of it there. <coughs> now, they're just, it's just up here somewhere. If we just got to the border here, we can see. March. Onward. Onward. Oh, where's he going? Not possible, sir. Forward. <laughs> I'm right on top of it. Okay, let's have a look. See what they've got. <coughs> okay, couple of what's that? Celtic medium cavalry and a speedo for a both jab cab, aren't they? Yeah. They've got some Ajema lights. Uh, Celtic Heavy Swordsman, they'll be hard to break down I would think, both of them, all three of them, <laughs> Crikey, Thrakitai, Hopley, Epilectoi, they look, um, yeah, they look as if they could do a bit of serious damage, but these guys, I like these guys, Crikey, alright, let's go find a way in. But they've got Atalos there, and um, I think he's a successor if he's not the leader. I can't remember now. Atalos is second. Atalos is first, I think, is who you start with as Pergamon. I remember um, I had a little uh, run through with it, did about 30 or 40 tons. <coughs> Excuse me, cool. Nice city. Shoulder your shields and Marco commands. There's a man. Penelius. No, no, he says. Let's go. Uh, oh, look at this view here. Let's have a little look. Wow. I know I've said it a dozen times before, but it is terrific what these guys come up with for this. Let's go and have a look at the settlement because. Um, I know I played it, I don't quite remember, um, I don't think I looked inside the settlement, but wealthy home. Mm, that looks like a portico. Another wealthy home. And there's a temple complex. Wow, that's some building, look at this. Pretty cool stuff. Yeah, I like this. Wealthy homes. Seems to be a few wealthy homes. Well, there's a bit of wealth that's going to be ours soon. Governor's residence, wow. Look at this place. It's got its own protective defensive wall. Buildings in the centre. I see them get walkways like.
Yeah, I have to see him pretty impressed with us. Market Square. No, Market, rather. There's a plaza. Signs and military training. Wow. I'm just looking at this and wondering how historical it is because this purple did they actually die the building? I wonder if they the same with us. Or has it just been buffed up Hollywood style to the mod? I really am impressed with it though. As you can probably tell, I've said it a few times before. Right, battle time. Let's go and get our army sorted. Get the litho down here. Archers. Uh, I'll put them there for now. First things first, let's take out the towers. And we've got them cavalry while we're sitting there. Let's take out this tower now. And pick off a few of these uh, German as well. The cavalry I'm sure we can take care of, but we could. These will be tough cookies to break down. All their infantry will be close up, look at these guys. Bodyguards, so you can pick off a few of them as well. Take out that tower. Oh, they look good, don't they? Of them, no? Down to 38. <coughs> Excuse me, Amps are doing a good job. <laughs> Just happened to get in the way. <laughs> Done a good job, the archers, haven't they? Right, well, let's have some of these buggers. Very aim down a bit. No, oh, keep turning around. Shields are on. take more of these out than the cavalry actually because um, these would be tougher to break down. Don't seem to be getting too many of them. Okay that'll do save some of your arrows for another time. Okay Litho, let's make a break here. Speed up a little bit. Smiled on us today. 
The walls are broken. Our troops should be ordered forward. Okay. We want them to come back up again. Was there some cavalry in amongst them? What the hell are they doing? The walls are breached, and the way into the city is open for our soldiers. Order the attack. I'm crazy. Whittle them right down, that'd be good. I less than six, then. Try them then. Just use your last few arrows on them. And the lethal as well. Ho ho! Your turn. Knock down a fence in as well. Could be halfway over here. I think the archers have shot their bolt. Yeah. Let's pick you up here out of the way, we don't need you now. Now, see the best way to. Uh, Make sure their soldiers are buried beneath their ruins. Arthur uh, Akatai unit will get you up in front of there as well. Take a few more of them out, take 54. Got smiled on us today. The walls are broken. Our troops should be ordered forward. Rackatanks. Just get in there and get them. Send you boys over. And Uh, 
it. And then we'll keep them occupied there. Send you down there. Before it kills our man. There you go, boys. Let's deal with my death blow as well. Up you go. Cavalry boys, get a close up view of this. Yeah. <laughs> Should go up, come on. She's standing up to this. It's only one soldier, come on. Hmm. That's just a little bit ridiculous, but there you go. What are we doing here? General's unit. Where is he? Where is that to look? You should have a different shield. No, you can't run away. Down there, there he is. There you go, the shield. Hold on a minute. Oh, it's missile car. And general car, they're both in there. The missile car, but obviously the ones without the shield. I'm trying to find that one. I thought he had a different shield from all the rest. They usually do. Press the shields all look. You have to see the workings and you see behind the shield as well. I wonder if he's out here somewhere. Ah, there he is. Do them. Come on, do them, boys. If I take them off guard. Got this part of one here. Look at these thracatines. Pergamon thracatines. Very tired. 
Alright, can we get these boys in? Terrific battles, really is. Quite what's happening here. Pathfinder seems to go in tits up. Your man here still fighting. That's a loss. Down to five men. Let's get these guys out there knackered. Yeah, exhausted as well. Let's get the fresh boys in, finish them off. <coughs> Excuse me. I think a few casualties right enough, but I think I expected that because the strength of the opposition. It's not always about numbers, is it? As we can rightly see here. It's a while to break them down, but I have to say, they're knackered. Have I got anybody else in reserve? Looks like it's uh, time for the general. Let's get him over. Where the hell is he going? He's left one battle to join in another one now. <laughs> got to be kidding me. Is that, is that Atalos? It sure is. These boys ought to take care of him. That done. These guys. Take a long time to break them down, isn't it? Still haven't done this lot in yet. Take you out of battle. Out of fight, rather. Alright, we'll send the fresh ones in. And they should dissolve this lot in seconds, because they're exhausted. They're all tired. Alright, let's just put you there. I haven't bloody killed this guy yet. <laughs> he must be bloody Superman or something. Let's go down and watch him die. Unbelievable, isn't it? There he goes. The king has been killed. This will surely make his followers waver. All right. 
right, we're going to see who's left in it. They're exhausted, they're tired. They're tired. Very tired. Everybody's knackered. We've still got another fight to go yet. Winded. Okay, you go and get him. Can you see him? Very tired, winded. Okay, let's get you in there. Very tired. Tired. I'm in there for crazy. Right, you're winded. And I've still got two. Uh, let's see here. Oh, these bloody Celtic swordsmen. Alright, we'll send you up for them. I can't even get empty tea, look. What the frig's going on? There we go. Go, 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 go. All right, General, down here. Give him a rally call before you leave. Enough run up here. Let's see him get charged right into the back of him. Spears down. Come on, Ken. No, no, no. Fucking rubbish. That distance should have been able to get the spears down easy. Charge is considerably weaker without the spears down. Waiting for orders. I don't think you can get the path find right. Nah. Where the hell are they going? Yeah. No. 
They can't even get the spears down either. There we go, that's it. That's better. Come on, see if we can get oh, Jesus Christ. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to put on a good show here with these charges and uh, there's nothing I can do about it, it's just the way the game is. Sorry about that, but I'm trying my best. I'm trying to give you a good visual. Spears down lads, come on. There you go. Terrific stuff. Surely that will weaken them. Let's try a general with bodyguard because they're heavier. See if we can get them to break. Any newcomers to uh, Roma Serectum are under no illusion. These battles are meant to be like this. They're trying to simulate what they're like in real life. So be prepared. Just can't get to, I can't get them to line up properly. Uh, once it's settled. That's them settled. Oh, I know it's a problem. Didn't see that. No, well, twat. Didn't notice they were, uh, this, now you should put them down this day. Come on. There we go. Go in with them. I love my cavalry charges when they turn out right. But uh, I didn't notice that they that they're going into this formation. Right, your turn. You're tough bastards, these um, kill kicks, aren't they? Well, we all are. <laughs> Should be done. Oh, dear me, that took a bit, didn't it? Yeah, still, yeah, it was good. Over 400 we lost. Gee, it shows you how strong the opposition were. So, at least we take the settlement, we take Gordium, and that's another for step to taking over Asia Minor. But, uh, yeah, you can see how tough it is. They have got the the, the bonuses, the plus seven bonuses of course for defence, uh, which is what they get with them um, very hard battle. And, and plus seven in attack and higher morale. So I know I've said it before but again for any newcomers or if you've never played it before if you decide to play on very hard, be prepared for the bonuses. They do extend the battles quite a bit. Right, let's get to that tax. Oh, look at this. Terrific. A new military capital. Fix the palaces. Fix the foundry. Retrain 
Right, see what we can do here. Yes, Merge up awesome. some of these. Construction. I think they deserve better than that, don't they? Let's build that and then a shrine, of course. And then we'll retrain what we can. Uh, how much money I got? Uh, not a lot. I might get a spy next time. Oh, dear me. Right, well, it was quite long that battle, a bit like um, over here at uh, Nicopolis. But uh, hopefully uh, I did enough to entertain you. Thanks for watching and uh, see you soon. Bye.